is Thomas and I'm here at the closed Big Kmart in Canton, Ohio. I believe this store closed 2016 or 17. I'll have to look it up and put it in the description, but you can see they've got everything kind of blocked off here. You can see some of the scarring from signs up there. We'll just kind of walk along this. It's definitely been closed for a while. It's overgrowing and everything. That's crazy. Yeah, this one can definitely be labeled as abandoned. You can see here is where the entrance was, but that's boarded up. And it's locked off here too, actually. You can see that's where it's locked. I'm not going to mess with it, but... That's where you would have been able to walk in. wonder why they boarded it. Someone probably broke in. A bit of vandalism here. From Juan. And so Oh. Well that's interesting. One of these is already is falling down. You can see it on this beam here. Damage. Jeez. This place is very, very Oh my god. Oh my god, look at that. That thing is like completely destroyed. All these pillars are just completely and utterly damaged. It's crazy. Now this is probably the, I think that was a little Caesar's sign if I remember. Now this place, this is probably the worst condition I've ever seen a closed Kmart in. <laughs> and that's not a joke. This is the boarded up, boarded up shop here for the garden shop. And then if we move over here you can see we got the old exterior garden shop and looks like not even that's immune to falling apart you can see there's trash and rubble everywhere and it's completely overgrown so if I move over here I'll show you guys there's an old like auto center out front there I'll go over there and film in a minute probably but this is the main Kmart itself in